in the cool water. And we're going to check and make sure it's a good warm temperature. And we're going to wet our wrist and our fingers. And don't grip all over the floor, okay? We're going to get some soap and we're going to get some good friction going. I'm going to distribute my soap. All right. Do the tops of my hands. I'll go ahead and do this wrist. I'll do the top of this hand. I'm going to go ahead and do this wrist. Now I want to get soap underneath my nails by doing it in the palms. I'm going to go ahead and do my cuticles. That's good soap we got. Now I'm going to clean under my nails using the thumbnail. Thumb to thumb, rinse, thumb to finger. Go right on down the line. Okay, now this hand. Thumb to thumb, thumb to finger. Through, through, and here. Now I'm going to rinse from the wrist down, not touching any part of the inside of the sink. Same over here. Make sure I got all the soap off. Now I got the dilemma here again, so I'm going to take my elbow, advance the paper. Pull it down. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. I'm going to dry my fingers. Going up to my wrist. Get a second paper towel to dry this hand. And again, if you need more than one paper towel to go back, let's say this hand wasn't dry enough and I need another paper towel to finish drying, I would say I need an extra paper towel to dry this hand thoroughly. turning my water off. You can turn the water on with your bare hands. Your hands are dirty. The sink is dirty. It's the turning off after you wash your hands that you'll bump